Hey, what's up everyone? This is DCSG81 and today we'll take a look at this Ban Pestro World Vehicle Coliseum for Android 17. Okay, so this is something new for me to review because I have uh, never reviewed the uh, Dragon Ball statue before because as you guys know, all my um, Dragon Ball are mostly from SH figures. So uh, it's an action figures, but this is actually a statue, it's non-articulable. So um, this is the first time I am doing it. So uh, without further ado, let's take a look at the box. So, um, previously when I show you, <laughs> that's actually the back of the box, so this is actually the front of the box, so you can see the, uh, it's from Ban Pestro, and it's a uh, Dragon Ball Z series, this is actually during the Cell Saga, the Ban Pestro World Figure Coliseum, um, it's on 2018, okay, I thought it was this year, so Android 17, uh, okay, there's some info here, so from the side here, we do see some information about the uh, special things. One piece, okay, it's pretty hard to see the woodings. Okay, and the side here is what we saw earlier. And from here, you can see there are actually two versions of the figure. One is the painted one, and another one is the all full grey color. Actually, I'm not sure why, why they actually released such version. Maybe some people. It maybe just it allows the collectors to paint themselves uh, or maybe some collectors just like to have this kind of version I'm not sure okay so we have the model sculptor here he's from Japan uh, his name is right I believe this is his name Varu is it okay not so sure this is his picture is here okay so let's get this open Okay, so um, this is quite special because um, most of my statue for the Dragon Ball usually it will need to assemble a very simple assembly. Uh, usually the, the head is pop off or the or half of the body is not assembled for easier um, for them to put inside the box. So but this one is a whole piece by itself. As you can see there's nothing to assemble. Okay. So it looks very cool and uh, this one is actually for the stand I believe okay, sorry about that and this is the base okay okay so before we assemble it let's take a closer look on the figures uh, sorry the statue so you can see um, the hair uh, if you have seen some of my uh, review before I did mention that I actually like when the hair is actually on the dynamic poses like this one is actually um when he's um flying not to say flying he's just uh surging oh uh forwards to i believe this part is uh, when he's attacking trunks if i'm not wrong yeah so there should be a android 18 together as well yeah if i can find the picture i'll show it to you guys on the screen now so um yep so they are actually uh like moving very fast forwards to trunks to attack trunks so this is why the dynamic poses you can see is made very very nice especially the hair the clothing and the face sculpted and painted very very nicely even the pants have some torn okay even the shoelace you can see the shoelace is looking very very detailed okay and his guns here okay. this piece is actually loose so the whole thing here is looking very very good this is what attracts me to this figure okay so i have actually put it um the the stands for the figures and right now it's looking like he's floating very very nicely so I really hope they uh, make it into a pair 
with Android 18 and then when you place it together, it looks very very cool. It's been some time since I'm attracted to a statue. So yeah, I try to avoid buying any more Goku and Vegeta <laughs> because I have too many. So this is why I get this one. This is very nice. I hope they don't stop on just Android 17. I hope they will have the Android 18. Or maybe if possible, they will make the uh, uh, trunks uh, standing here like ready to fight. Then it will be very cool to have three of them together. Yep. So um, stay tuned for more pictures at the end of the video. So I'll try to capture some pictures close up of the figure for you to see. And until then, I think um, that's all for my review. So I hope you enjoy it. This is my first review on the Dragon Ball statue. And I hope you enjoy it. Uh, hopefully, there will be more interesting uh, statue like this, which will interest me to get and then I can review for you guys. Okay, so I hope you like this video. Give me a thumbs up if you like it and uh, leave me a comment if you like to know more about it. And also subscribe to my channel if you like my content so far. Until then, I'll speak to you real soon. Bye.